The 2011 class of high school basketball players in Mississippi was loaded. You had guys that went to Georgetown, LSU, Mississippi State, even Ole Miss. Then you had Michael Lamons signing with South Alabama. People always ask me, how come I didn't go to like a bigger name school? It wasn't really about the school. It was more about the people that I was going to be at the school, you know, molding me as a person. And um, I just want to put myself around good people, and I think I did that. And I think it's going to pay off in the long run. Once highly recruited by colleges across the country, a lot of programs backed off Ammons' his senior year because of injury concerns. So he chose to come here to South Alabama with a lot to prove. I think I always play with a play with a chip on my shoulder. Um, even in high school, you know, he was saying Rodney Hood was better than me. And um, all my career, like, I, I, I sort of seemed to be, be like number two. <laughs> and I think, it, I think it's what got me to the point that I'm at right now. Where he's at, a full-time starter as a sophomore, second on the team in scoring and rebound. Ammon's inside, strong move. Oh, reverses his dribble, oh, goes up and puts it in. He's very physically gifted for his age, so he came in as a freshman, and you know we joke and call him man-child half the time because he, he came in as a man and, and plays like that. We expect a lot from him. We did last year as a freshman, and I think he's picked up his game. And as a sophomore, he's, he's certainly become one of the better players in the Sun Belt. You can easily argue that Ammons has been the most productive college player from that 2011 class. A lot of it leads back to his maturity and the drive to reach his goals on and off the court. I'm going to get my degree before I go anywhere, but um, playing for a ball has always been something that I want to do, and I'm going to keep on fighting for it. In Mobile, Travis Raychek, WLBT Sports.